Hey, what is going on, guys? It is Sean from Double Clutch HD, and I am coming at you with episode number 17 of the Angels franchise. And I did a little, I did a trade at the beginning. Let me explain that a little. It was Nick Castellanos, uh, Hack Julie, and uh, Chris Archer for Cliff Pennington and Tyler Moore on my team. So, um, yeah, let me explain this trade a little bit. Uh, I'm going to put some, uh, some gameplay of me playing the Pirates in the background at home. So anyway, back to the trade. Uh, Nick Castellanos, he is one of the biggest pieces of, of this trade, and he is one of the top one, top 50 prospects, I believe, in the MLB. Uh, he is an A, a or B potential left fielder, uh, highly coveted for his uh, for his potential and his overall, which is like an 81. And um, yeah, he was a big part of the trade. And then Chris Archer, he was the second second key part of the trade. And uh, Chris Archer, he was the you, you you all know him for being a great for being a stud this year for the Tampa Bay Rays, and I'm really excited to have him. Probably put him in AAA for a couple of seasons, watch him develop, and maybe put him back in the put him in the ro starting rotation. And I'm excited for him. Heck, Lee, he was just kind of a throw in. Um, I need I wanted a pro shortstop prospect since I was losing one, and so I got a pretty good prospect, 64 overall, B potential. And I'm going to try to develop him. Uh, I, I remember this year he was supposed to, to be, he, he was developing pretty well. But hold on. Let me take a break from this explanation and show Mark Trumbo hitting a Trumbomb to left field. That is a long gone right there into the stands, past the, past the bullpen. And Mark Trumbo shows off his power once again for the Angels. So now, now that we're done uh, glorifying Mark Trumbo, <laughs> let me get back to the trade. So um, Hachu Lee, as I was saying, he was um, he was injured. He was supposed to be developing really well, but he injured both legs, I think. And so um, that's in real life. In in uh, in, in the game, he, he's a good, pretty good pretty uh, good player. Uh, I'm just gonna keep him in the minor league system for a while. Maybe trade him away for a couple good players. So anyway, on my side, I had Cliff Pennington and Tyler Moore. You might be like. Wow, man, you got a steal. And yeah, I do agree. That was a steal. But uh, why the Tampa Bay Rays would take that trade? Um, Cliff Pennington, he was he's a 76 overall, I believe. And um, he was uh, he, he was uh, stashed on the bench with the uh, arriving of Elvis Andrews. And he was actually a gold glover for us, but Andrews is just is the better player. And so we had to trade him away. And he's a B potential shortstop of... Who is who's developing pretty well? He's only 26 years old, and I guess the Tampa Bay Rays needed a shortstop, a starting shortstop, and um, yeah, that's probably why they took that trade. I ain't mad, and I give, and they were willing to trade Cliff Penning. They wanted me to give up Cliff Pennington for all three guys on their team, and I was like, ah, that's not fair. So I gave him the B potential uh, left fielder Tyler Moore because I I lost a shortstop, so I got a shortstop back. And then they lost a left fielder in Nick Castellanos, so I wanted to give them back a left fielder, you know. Uh, so I think that was a pretty fair trade after adding in Tyler Moore. And I'm really excited for this team after that trade. Nick Castellanos can now start for us uh, in left field. We, we were lacking a left fielder. JB Shuck was doing a good job, but we just needed someone else that would be better, I guess, uh, to fill in, fill in that 6-7 hole. And yeah, I'm really excited for this trade. So let's get back into the commentary. And you saw Chris Iannetta get a sack fly a minute ago. And now here's Colin Calgill, who was playing DH, I believe. And Mike Olt, you are not fast enough. You are not freaking Juan Pierre. You do not, you do not try to score on that play. That was a bad baseball mistake. But uh, the Angels still have a three nothing lead. And it, it's only the bottom of the second. Mike Trout check swing, great discipline, but not so great running on the base pads by Colin Calgill. So you saw Mar uh, Russell Martin. He was he had the same situation a couple innings ago. No one out or one out, bases loaded, and he can't come through right there. And so here's I think this is Reed Johnson or Chris Johnson. Oh no, that's not good. No, it's Bueno, and there goes our lead. We're down 3-4 now. I think that's, yeah, I think that's Reed Johnson. Hit the grand slam. And, yeah, Josh Hamilton has something to say about that, though. Right after that, he gets a base hit. And the Angels are going to try to start a rally here. They need to get back in this game. The momentum has shifted to the 
Pirates side and the Angels need something going right here. Michael Young trying to make something happen. That is blooped to right field for a base hit. And Josh Hamilton is easily going to get to third as that was hit in a perfect spot for a first to third attempt. So now Mike, old 2-0 count. Curveball, that was hanging right there. And that should be a double play ball, but no! The third baseman throws it over the second baseman's head! And Michael Young's gunned out anyway, but we still escape with a run. And we have a man on second still. So that was a terrible error right there. Here's Chris Iannetta, two outs, man on second. Can he take the lead? Yes, he can. Base hit to center field. McCutcheon is going to come up firing, but he's not going to get Mike Old at home. And the Angels have themselves another. Ha, they've tied up the game, and then they took the lead again. And that's going to disappear the next inning as Neil Walker hits a home run going into si simulation. Uh, Weaver was struggling, so I decided to take control. And now he's going to throw it on the second. This is a great double play ball. Ooh, but great take outside by Gabby San Or no, excuse me, Neil Walker. I no, Pedro Alvarez. Ah, I can't get the names right. But here's Gabby Sanchez. He's going to strike out. And Jared Weaver is getting into some jams, but he's working well through them. Here's, uh, I don't know who that is, but he's not, oh, I think that's Reed Johnson. The guy hit the grand slam, and he's going to just line out. So the Pirates leave some men on base, and Howie Kendrick going to get himself a nice base hit. Just hitting the perfect spot. Not a good piece of hitting, but he still gets the job done. Going to get on first to lead off the sixth, fifth inning. Excuse me. Now Mark Trumbo, one out. He is going to drive this to right field for a base hit. And Charlie Morton has been getting hit pretty... He's been, get, he's been giving up a lot of hits for the Pirates and let's see what Elvis Andrews can do with two outs I'm gonna tap it back up the middle and it's gonna be a tough play and they're not gonna get out the speedy Andrews and the Angels have the bases loaded with two outs Michael Young Mr. Clutch comes through that's a base hit to center field McCutcheon has to gather and the Angels are gonna score two more runs it's gonna give them the lead Michael Young with another nice hit for us Playing pretty well starting at third base. And that's going to be it for Charlie Morton. Filling in for Garrett Cole. Gave up seven runs today. Uh, I guess two of them were unearned. And Aaron Harang, who is on the Pirates now, is on the mound. And he's going to get Mike Olt to ground out to shortstop. Ooh, close play right there. But the Pirates get out of the inning. So Jerry Weaver is still struggling. Gives up a double to Russell Martin. And that's gonna they're gonna score another run. Daniel Bard in relief. And he's gonna get out of that inning. So let's see what the Angels can do. Can they push this back this lead back up to to two? So Chris Ionetta gonna drive it to right field. Deep to right field and he caught it. So it doesn't even matter anyway. <laughs> but that was a good piece of hitting by Chris Ionetta, just not long enough to get out. Here's Mark Trumbo. 1-0 count. One out and see ya! Gone, another home run for Mark Trumbo. And that's two solo shots on the day. This time the left center field. And Mark Trumbo just has been dynamic for us in this game. Uh, he's been the difference actually as we are up by two now. And the Angels have themselves an, have themselves another two point cushion. Let's see if they can keep this in, keep this lead this time and maybe take home this victory in front of the home crowd. And the first one he pulled to left field. This time he was a bit more on time. And he got that to left center field. And was, you cannot do that Aaron Herring. A fastball right down the middle. He knew it as soon as he threw it. And Mark Trumbo makes him pay. So ninth inning Ernesto Frieri coming on the pitch. Strikes out Jose Tabata. And the Angels are in business. And Ernesto Frieri 1-2 count to Neil Walker. High fastball swing and a miss. And the Angels are one out away from walking out of here with a win. Despite giving up a grand slam, Andrew McCutcheon going to fly that to right center field. And Josh Hamilton is going to range over and make the catch. Angels win another game. And light up that halo as the Angels des definitely deserve this game. Showing gr gr a great uh, display of offense today. Jared Weaver did not have a good game. But he still fought through it, got out of a few jams, and he's going to get pick up the win, I think, in this game. And Ernesto Frieri lights out in the ninth inning, not even allowing a guy to reach base here. And uh, just a great overall, re all, uh, great overall win for the team. 
as Mark Trumbo hit two solo shots. And that proved to be the difference, and the Angels are going to win this game. What a great job by the Angels today to rack up some hits and then some clutch hitting. Michael Young with that clutch two RBI single, and Jared Weaver does pick up the win despite giving six earned runs. Not good for the for the uh, for the ERA, but still good for the win column. And who is our player of the game today? Let's see here. And it is Mark Trumbo. No surprise. Has some trade rumors swirling around him. And since this is the MLB offseason, he seems it seems like he's always going to get traded. But um, still doing well in my game. And Mark Trumbo just proves to be invaluable to the team m multiple times. And with the departure of Albert Pujols, he needs to be uh, a key part of this offense. And he proved that he's off to a good start today. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, this was a pretty exciting game. So leave a like if you like. If leave a like if you enjoyed. And um, I will talk to you guys later. Um, and you guys have a good day. Stay safe. Uh, just keep warm. It's getting colder. So I will see you guys later. And yeah, guys, I'll talk to you later. Bye.